do our horror playthrough of Man of Medan. What's going on here? Can't do anything with this. Oh, right, got it. Is that it? Oh, no. Going through. So. Alright, yep. Thank you. Last time, they've just come up from the uh, wreckage. Up. Can't wait to see this sucker for myself. Uh, oh, okay. I'm gonna go find Julia. She's not that far away, mate. She didn't even go downstairs. Hey, almost time for barbecue. Got the pad yet? Oh, no, not yet. I got distracted. You didn't give me much time, mate. Let's be honest. Got it. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. Oh, I'd settle down, buddy. Easy, tiger. We should get back. Right here. <laughs> I love how they're all just sitting there awkwardly. <laughs> no one's talking. Hey, well there, sailor. Um, excuse me? Yeah, Careful. what the hell? If you did decompress too fast, then you should go easy on the beer. Uh, Alex, I'm fine. I think if I got the bends, I would know by now. Yeah. Not always. Sometimes the bends can be super delayed. It could be hours or a day or two. The bends? Yeah, it's uh, when you come up from a dive too fast. Oh, 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 yeah, uh, uh, decompression sickness. <laughs> Nerd. Little what? nitrogen bubbles that get stuck what? in your bloodstream. Hurts like a bitch. It's really serious. Divers get sick and die from decompression sickness every year. And that is why the good Dr. Conrad says drink them if you got them, because either you're fine or you're going to want a little something to ease the pain. Julia, yeah, exactly. I'm telling you not to drink any alcohol right now. Oh, come you're on. Don't tell me what to do. I'm telling you? Take orders from this guy? Just drink a beer. Exactly. No, let's beer o'clock. Beer o'clock? If the captain hasn't said anything, it's fine. She should know. All right, everyone. Check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. Do you find anything else? We did find a bullet stuck in the fuselage, but that was about it. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. He wasn't down there with whatever us. Whatever you took, it was too much. Uh, now let's be apologetic. You're right. We should have been more careful. Everyone's gonna be nice to Fliss. Sorry. Everyone's mean to the brother. Okay, maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? I'll talk about yeah, respecting. I heard a story. The people died it out here. Right around here. Can you tell us a ghost story? We could all use a good show. Yeah, let's hear it. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait. In the middle of the ocean. Story? Where'd you hear this? What well, lighthouse? You need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman, covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. 
Uh, let's be like one track mind. Aha, uh -huh, funny. One track mind. The woman answers. I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? Of course Just they do. the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. You know, sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. Sorry, it's I okay. was reading. That's why I didn't okay, answer so what was going on. Who did it? The woman says, it was my husband. And she turns to the closet and says, he's in there. Ah, yes, the husband. And that's why I've always been a little weary of marriage. So the lighthouse oh. keeper creeps over to the closet. Alex went like that. Door. And sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> yeah, he's so gross. Uh, hey, oh, super twin. That's another nice. good jump. <laughs> nice one, Squire. I knew that one was coming, so I didn't jump as much. Oh, come on, that wasn't scary. I think you told it better last time. But good effort. Okay, you've all had your fun. We should all turn in, there's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh, no, 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 because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, it's standard issue, regulatory institutional protocol, subdivision 1099. Uh-huh, <laughs> where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, ma'am. Hey, I want that <laughs> website. <laughs> and four good buddies. And I'm out. I like that the brother was like, oh, he told this ghost story better last time, but he literally said, I only read about this on the magazine flying in. So. Make sure you turn your brightness up in the settings for this. Ooh. Yeah, make sure your screen brightness is up for these videos as well. I accidentally had it turned down while I was viewing them to make sure they're okay. I get that? I, I don't know if I got that or not. Quit. I wasn't holding the control, so I don't know <laughs> if I did this correctly. Sometimes I'll fail the cutscene or the quick times on purpose. Sometimes I try and get them done. Just depends what mood I'm in. Um, who do we want to? Uh, well, we're Conrad, so we're in love with Fleece right now. That's the uh, narrative I've got going for him. Let's be all sorry. God damn it. This is all my fault. I'm 
sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I like that no one's bothered on gagging Alex yet. He's not gagged everybody. <laughs> hey! Hey! Huh? Damn it! Stop it! <sighs> Almost free. Think she's flexible. I probably wouldn't be able to do that. Ah, oh, someone's finally on gagging Alex. Hey, so uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh god damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How was that good news? <laughs> I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Hey. Alex, what are they gonna do to us? I don't even want to know. Get out of here. I'm a lot of danger. Uh, let's go investigate. We're not untying them. I deliberately failed that one. I just wanted him to get punched. Uh, I'll be back for you later. Conrad! Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go they do know we're out here. You piece of shit. You're the little lady. We radioed in about the wreckage. We told them where we were. Even though we didn't uh, report the wreckage, they still knew where we were. They stop. want money. Please, just stop. Slow down. Easy. Please. Just stop, man. Gonna try and make Conrad a nice guy. Say, like, how long has it taken them to get from the cabin tour? Like, it's taken them a while to walk this little stretch of, uh, of land. Land? Room? Corridor? Oh, Jesus, Conrad. They didn't hurt him that much. Stick. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, deep stick. I don't think they're gonna hit her. They haven't hit Fliss. Fliss sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with them. Yeah, the only one got hit was Conrad. Is <laughs> this my brother? Uh. Uh, dismiss him. No. But I'm, I'm sure he's fine. These guys probably just want money or something. 
Yeah. Like, I like that they haven't noticed that we don't have the tape Maybe we can take them by surprise. on our mouths and we're okay. untied. Coming. Of course I did. Now we just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. Ransom you. It's usually what they do. Take it. Yeah. I'm gonna take miles, not eight yeah, kilometers. The main guy, yeah. And he's got a gun. Well, at least one of us can get on their boat. Get some help. Uh. Let's be all like, I can get on there. I can get on that boat. The dude with the gun won't even realize until I'm long gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. Good call. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys, distract them. Conrad, just stay focused and get to the boat. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. One, two, three, four. Ah, uh, whoops. What are you thinking? Ah. Oh, so <laughs> if you fail it, they still the don't fail it. Okay. Traits updated. Incompetent. That's oh, one of the heartbeat things. Okay, what well, they're gonna hear my heartbeat, are they? If I fail this. Escape, bro. Escape. What's taking him so long? Get away! Or... Oh fuck! Oh, well, is he dead, is he? Oh, let him go. We can't catch him with this old junker. Oh, he died anyway. Whoops. Bring them downstairs. Take this. Use it if you have to. Well, Conrad's dead. I wasn't expecting that last quick time event. Over there. You, right here. Sit. Now. Arrêtez, bande de cons! C'est mon bateau! Stop! Ferme-la, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule! Which one of you is going to tell me about this Manchurian goo?
So we're just fleecing now because we just killed off Conrad. Connie can take care of himself. Alright! Shut the fuck up! Maybe he didn't die. I think he's dead though. Uh, we're only talking. No harm in we'll even be nice to them. We're just gonna be an ass to the brother. Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna say it. Fliss has got to be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's the captain, and they barely laid a hand on her. I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. Enraged. Oh, this people like I can't uh, believe what I'm hearing. Destroyed. I just lost everything I have, and this is what you think? You're all in this together. This was a trap, and you set us there up. There I are, so. Put a cork in it. Oops, I wasn't holding my control when that happened. Sorry, <laughs> that wasn't a deliberate fail. But... Sit still, all of you. Uh, yeah, sit still. You. Come with me. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Will you try anything? Anything fishy. And there'll be consequences. Get it. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Okay. Over. No, we're gonna be all. Listen to me. We have been kidnapped. I repeat, SOS, we are 20 miles north of. Ah! That was a brilliant idea. Uh, let's be afraid now. <laughs> no, 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 please stop. Feel like I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean it. Ah, we saved it. Oh, oh, we just saved it. Him off the side. Just cut it all, Luke. Keep the guy off the side. Uh, let's just hold on. Hey, move it now. Job looking after number one. Real smooth. Great leadership, Fliss. What happened? There's more awkward silence. Do you know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? I don't know where he is. Could we just be like, hey guys? You could help. Yeah. Okay, keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Ah, oh, we should have said he could Brad drown. Stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. Didn't really Brad's mean to help boy. him. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. I was more like, he could come and help us. That's more what I was thinking, not, oh, if he stays down there, he can sneak out and help us. Dear, oh dear, you appear to have lost another one already. 
Yeah. Some people should take greater care over Another the decisions one. that they make. We lost another one. We lost one. Kind hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? No. You're going it alone. Independent. Admirable. Possibly foolish. We'll learn soon enough. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. But here's a thing. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. Probably shouldn't have said that. <laughs> I like him. He's really good, that guy. La porte! La porte! Vite! La porte! Jumping on the World War II ship now. The ship with all the monsters from the start. What the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> You're gonna die. <laughs> I've made all the choices that hopefully kill you very quickly. charge of her now am I? I am. So now that we're back in charge we're gonna pause it right there we're gonna end this video right here our current objective will be to follow the kidnappers uh, this playthrough is getting interesting uh, we've lost Conrad already I think what's her face the diver's gonna die soon so we'll just have to keep going and see what happens so Thank you all very much for watching. Please give the video a like, give the channel a subscribe. This is going to keep going through Halloween. So thank you very much for watching. I've been PJ the Average Gamer. This has been the Dark Pictures Man of Medan. Thank you very much. I'll see you next time.